What's up guys, it's TechRacoon back with another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at what I found on Hard Rubbish. It's, um, Hard Rubbish is basically just, like, people throwing it out. And so I found an, uh, Dell Vostro desktop PC. It's the Vostro 430 and it has an i7-870. And it's got, the processor is base clocked at 2.9 GHz with turbo boost to 3. 6 gigahertz now it's a quad core 8 threaded cpu and it has a cinebench score of about 480 roughly around that mark now that's just um stock now this one has an aftermarket cooler but it's i mean it's by dell so it's nothing like special you can't really overclock on it so yeah i'm not gonna overclock this cpu but this computer is actually really quiet but when when it's actually at full 100% uh, CPU usage, it gets really loud. It sounds like, I guess you could say, vacuum cleaner or blower or something. Yeah, it's really loud. Um, but that doesn't bother me because I usually go into a different room. Or, um, it doesn't really bother me in general. Uh, the CPU is quite good in video editing, although this one only, this Adel Vostro 430 only comes with a, a G2220 graphics card, which comes equipped with 1GB of VRAM, which is not very much. But that that's pretty much all I need to be honest, because I don't do any gaming on this CP, uh, computer. Yeah, so it has uh, eight gigs of RAM, and it has uh, just a Dell stock motherboard. I also have 1.5 terabytes of storage. Um, I've got a 500 gig hard drive for the operating system, and then a one terabyte hard drive for all the stuff. Because I didn't have an SSD lying around, so I have to use a hard drive. But yeah, it works quite well, and it has a lot of USB ports at the front, has four, then it has all the SD card readers and all that. Um, it's quite useful to have all of that at the front, you don't have to use a USB to SD card converter, so that's quite useful. And um, at the back, it has no USB 3s, this computer, it's from 2009, like all the computers I find pretty much. But yeah, it's, it's not too bad actually, it's, I guess you could say, well, actual performance wise it it's like 80 percent of what a ryzen 3 is so it's not too bad the power supply I came with is a 350 watt dell power supply and it just got the stock dell case on it it's designed for windows 7 obviously um yeah but it's quite upgradable you can put many hard drives in there and so on so it's good for future upgradability, and you could probably put like some Z on with it, 1156 uh, sockets. So yeah, it's you can you can do a bit of upgrading to it, but it's mostly just for editing. So yeah, next week I'll be showing you my editing setup. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week with another video. Now. This video is posted one day early because tomorrow I'm going to be away so I won't have time to post this video. So yeah, see you guys next week.